Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I just want to do a quick vlog style video and I want to say happy Valentine's Day to you guys. Sorry for my lack of videos. I've been sick for two weeks straight and today I finally have the energy and I felt decent enough to go get my hair done. And I actually had the appointment already set, so it worked out perfectly. And I'm currently just wearing some contact lenses. And Joy does my hair as usual at Ulta in Maywood. And she did an amazing job. So perfect. She um, sometimes does it like way too purple and like the toner kind of messes up my hair. But today, um, she literally stood and watched my hair while it was being toned. So it didn't turn all weird and it's just like a perfect shade of blonde. And I was going to dye my hair um, either rose gold or something, but everyone says that this suits me, and I think so too. So I just decided to keep it for now, and on top of that, I didn't really want to change my hair too much like right before Valentine's Day. I know that sounds weird, but I just didn't want to like, you know, do something I didn't like, and tomorrow is Valentine's Day, so I just didn't want to, you know, mess up my hair. So yeah, I really, really like this. So this is the first present that I'm going to give to the boo. I'm just going to put like alcohols inside of this chocolate heart shaped box. This is what the cover looks like and then I'm just going to put like, I just bought a bunch of different alcohol that I'm going to put that I think he likes and then this is what the chocolate that came inside. Um, I don't know, I'm probably not going to give it to him, I'm just probably just going to do this and then fill it up with like a bunch of candy. So I changed my mind about the Starburst. I think maybe if I just like toss them in here or something. It'll be cute, but I feel like lining them with the Ferrero Rocher chocolate looks better, so yeah, I don't know. Does it look good with the Starburst? And it does not, like, not necessary. Let's take some out. Alright, so I'm basically done, and I just taped it down with just some scotch tape. Ta-da! Yeah. So I just taped it down so it doesn't move around while it's in here, and then the lid still closes, which is awesome. Yeah, it's a little bit thick, but it actually fits nicely in there, and I just loved how it turned out. I mean, I didn't really plan this. I knew I just wanted to do like a heart-shaped box with some alcohol and candy in it, but I didn't really have the idea to do this, but it kind of just came to me after I saw these, so yeah, these came in really handy. My mom actually picked these up from, uh, <laughs> from the school that she goes to that one of her clients works at. Anyway, not important, but yeah, these chocolates came in really handy, and... I think it's cute. I mean, I don't know. I'm just so cheesy and I don't know. I just like doing shit like this. So yeah. We got Fireball Rum Haven, which is similar to Malibu. They didn't have that or else I would have gotten that because I know he liked that one. And then Grey Goose, I just like the bottle Kahlua and Jack Daniels Fire, which is supposed to be like Fireball. So this is the outfit I'm going to wear tonight. This is my red velvet dress that you've probably seen in my misguided haul. I don't know why, but the neckline is a lot lower than when I first wore it, and I don't know, maybe it got larger in the wash or something, which is usually the opposite of what happens, but this part seems a little bit lower, and I'm just pairing it with this black um, Urban Outfitters bralette. So yeah, and my hair looks super long, and I love my hair long. I actually just did it. As you saw in my intro, so my roots are like completely dyed and beautiful. And um, I'm just wearing socks right now, so I don't really want to show my feet because you can't wear shoes inside an Asian house, if you guys didn't know. <laughs> but yeah, this is currently um, my outfit for tonight. Try to, oops. Trying to get a better angle. Um, I haven't done an actual outfit of the night video in a while, so if you guys want those videos, let me know. But yeah, I just wanted to film this really quick video before I go out tonight. I think this is a cute thumbnail. What do you guys think? <laughs> yeah, definitely. I just realized I'm watching this video. I forgot to put on my watch and my earrings. Oh no. But I got my Tiffany's bracelet and my Jade bracelet that never ever come off. So yeah. Red for Valentine's Day, of course. I didn't vlog too much of my Valentine's Day during the day, but it wasn't really that interesting. Like I went with my mom to the city to do some errands 
and then I just had to wait for her for a while so I was like playing Pokemon Go and like sitting in the car for like an hour and I just got like a little something to eat and yeah that was about it and I didn't feel like I don't know I also didn't even bring my camera out so there I couldn't even vlog anyway so yeah I just figured I would show you guys my outfit before I go so really quick this is a little random and sneak peek of what's inside my bag but I love this thing this is the Pokemon Go Plus and shout out to Alan who bought this for me he's one of my photographers that I've known for so long but he saw this on my Amazon wish list, so if you guys see anything on my wish list and you want to get me something, just pick something from there. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, but um, seriously, I love this thing. It's really cool. I think I'll do like a separate review on this on my channel, but basically, you just press the button, connect to your phone on Pokemon Go, and you can have like your phone um, screen turned off, so you don't have to look at your phone while you're playing it, and then um, it turns blue when there's a Pokestop, and it turns green when there's... Pokemon nearby and you just press it and most of the time it catches it for you like I've caught some pretty good stuff like I caught a Porygon, Abra, Jigglypuff and yeah it's pretty good stuff actually and it's so easy to collect stuff from the Pokestops now like I drove past a Pokestop at like 35 miles per hour and I still got it and um, if I did it on my phone like that would never happen you know so yeah I really like this I totally recommend it if you want to play Pokemon Go and not really play if you know what I mean so yeah, that's my mini review. So last night he gave me this rose. It's so pretty. It's like a rainbow color. I absolutely love colorful things and everything rainbow. So I love it so much. Thanks, babe. So we actually didn't end up going out last night, even though I really wanted to, and I got dressed up. But I guess it just got kind of late, and we're probably gonna just go out on Friday when he gets paid or whatever. I mean, I don't mind paying, but. I know it probably makes him feel bad, so yeah, I mean, we're gonna go out later this week, so it's okay. It's all good, and now I'm just going to go run some errands and go get gas in my car, and that's about it, so hope you guys enjoy this really quick, simple Valentine's vlog. I think it was just mostly for my outfit, <laughs> so yeah, I will talk to you guys really soon. I love you guys.